Hello, Wellness Warriors. Ah, I'm so happy that you're here. I'm so happy you're watching. Um, you know, I just hope that you're being kind to yourself and thanking yourself. Like, there's a reason why this is called Wellness Warrior. And it's because, you know, you guys are warriors and you are in, like, trying to be in tune with yourselves and trying to work on your wellness and you're showing up. And I hope that you're being kind to yourself and just really, truly showing up and giving yourself grace and going, okay, like, I am doing the work. I'm doing the hard work. I am being kind to myself. Um, or are trying. I am um, doing the hard work. I'm being in the arena and I'm getting my ass kicked, like Brene Brown says. Um, I'm showing up to therapy. I am trying to do meditation. I'm trying to practice mindfulness. I'm trying to get movement in. I'm trying to be careful with what I choose to put in my body and I'm just not talking just like food and, and drinks but also everything else information uh people's I don't know I guess people's um even people's energies all of that like just people's people's energies uh their perceptions their opinions just where your energy is going um you know, you're doing the work. And sometimes I feel like we forget to thank ourselves for that. So I hope that you are thanking yourself for showing up and for doing the hard work and wanting to get better. Uh, one of my questions the other day for my clients was, why are you here? Why are you showing up? Like, what is your, your why? Which I talked a little bit about that the other day on the beach. Like, you have to have a why, right? And... You know, your why is so important and that's what helps you to show up and that is what helps you to keep going and that is what helps you to continue to grow. And I think it's important for you to remind yourself that you're fighting for this why and that you're doing this hard work because of this why. And you need to thank yourself because there is a speech with Snoop Dogg. I don't know if you guys have seen it where he's like, I want to thank myself for my hard work. I want to thank myself for showing up. And I was like, yes. And we need to be doing that. We need to be thanking ourselves. Um, earlier today, I was talking with another therapist because she's selling this really cool heart that says Latina therapist. And I was like, oh my God. So we connected and she's from California and we were just talking about like the um, the populations we work with and it was so nice to connect with a Latina therapist. It was nice to connect with a Latina therapist who speaks Spanish. It was nice to connect with someone who is a brown therapist with their private practice and it was just really awesome to connect with someone you identify with. And I started thinking like, when she was asking me what I do and I was saying it out loud and I said I need to be more grateful to myself for all the hard work that I have put in I need to be more grateful to myself for the hard work that I have constantly persistently and with lots of tenacity continue to do for years that no one sees because Many people just see the, like the Olinka wellness posts and you see the videos, but you don't see like the research that goes behind it or uh, the hard work that's been put in or the paperwork that I do or, I mean, the sessions after sessions that I do or the groups and I'm living my dream, uh, but it's taken work, so much work and and it's a balancing act because I'm also, I'm living my biggest dream, the most revolutionary thing I've ever done, which is being a mom. So I'm raising two boys in a patriarch, patriarch college society. And sometimes my English just, in un patriarcado. I don't even know how to say it in English, but you know, the patriarchy. 
and lots of oppression for brown people even though people are like no there's none of that yes there is if you want to know what come talk to me i'll i'll school you and all of that affects us and so I'm, I'm doing the most revolutionary thing, which is raising these boys. And then I'm also achieving my dreams and being a therapist. And, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm the director of an emotional program, emotional overeating program at an eating disorder center. Like, and for those of you who know about eating disorders and treatment and eating disorders, most therapists are white. So it is a world full of white therapists. And then there's me. And, um... So there's that. And then um, I just, there's so much in my heart. Um, and then talking about all these things, it just makes you go, wow, this is so cool. Like I am truly my, some of my ancestors' wildest dreams. And like my parents didn't graduate college. Um, and they're some of the smartest people I, I I've ever met um my dad's a taxi driver who like can talk about anything and uh my mom she speaks four languages and uh, and she raised us she stayed home and she's a domestic engineer and uh to be where i'm at today really is a great honor and i'm actually getting emotional and to be a brown woman doing this. And so sometimes I forget that I should really thank myself because I I looked at my dreams and I said, this is what I want. I, you know, like I want to write a book and then I want to write a second book. And I, I, had, I, I had a lot of moments where people said to me, I was not going to amount to anything. People in middle school. And I'm not saying just like, classmates i'm talking about teachers teachers in high school uh i remember one of them clearly said to one of my best friends at the time do not hang out with her she's going to amount to nothing people like her will never make anything with their lives and uh gosh i wish he could see me now i'm like <laughs> but um I think it's important to thank ourselves for what we're doing and thank ourselves for showing up, for doing the dirty work, for whatever it is that causes you fear and you still have done it or whatever has cost, um, like it's been a struggle and we've all struggled one way or another. So like those, those struggles that you have faced and you have overcome looking at it and going oh my gosh like I've made it and I have surpassed them and I have continued to show up and maybe you're not a hundred percent there yet but you've improved so today if you take anything from this video and you've made it this far I know I've like reminisced a lot uh it's to thank yourself for everything you're doing and to live in that gratitude of everything that you have overcome and how you have continued to fight and show up for yourself so thank you for watching i hope that you're having a wonderful day and if you're not then i hope that you can be kind to yourself give yourself grace and maybe do one good thing for yourself that can help you out thank you wellness warriors don't forget to hit subscribe we're at 172 subscribers thank you the love is felt so bye